Senate President Ahmed Lawan says investigation being carried out by the Senate into the finances of the Niger Delta Development Commission NDDC is to complement the ongoing forensic audit which was ordered by the federal government. Lawan stated this while inaugurating a seven-man ad hoc committee on alleged financial recklessness in the NDDC. He said the Senate is in total support of President's directive for the forensic audit of the finances of the NDDC. The investigation, he said, would avail the management of the commission an opportunity to defend the allegations against it. Lawan said the NDDC, as a pioneer intervention agency in the country, should take the lead on how its intervention could be effective, efficient, and meet the yearnings of the people. We have no predetermined position on the outcome of this investigation as an institution. The issues raised are allegations, and therefore the NDDC, the Commission, has the opportunity to come forward and defend its position. But we have a mindset. We have a mindset. And our mindset in the Senate is that we have to have a Niger Delta Development Commission that is effective and efficient in service delivery to the people of Niger Delta. This is the essence of setting up that commission. So we want to see a situation where the very limited resources that are appropriated for the Niger Delta Commission prudently, economically, and transparently. In his remarks, Chairman of the Ad hoc Committee, Senator Olubumi Adetumbi, described the allegations that necessitated the setting up of the committee as numerous and weighty as it involved implication and misappropriation of 40 billion naira, amongst others. He assured the Senate leadership of the committee's resolve to be open-minded in the process. This is juncture to assure you and the entire leadership of the Senate as I speak on behalf of my other members here present, all of us are here, that we intend to discharge this responsibility openly, without prejudice, and without any preconceived opinion, other than to be open and to ensure that our process of inquiry will be transparent for the public to see uh, in the best interest of our nation. Other members of the committees include Senator Azan Adija, Senator Dauda Jika, Senator Umar Almakura, Senator Barinada Mbigi, Senator Abdul Fatai Buhari, and Senator Chukuka Utazi.